hi guys so I did say that I should start vlogging on a regular basis this isn't very regular yet but I figured I'd jump on here real quick and at least put something up since I only have my phone with me I can't record off my computer I guess I could off the work computers but it's probably not a good idea because I am at work <laughs> um, I, I initially wanted to do something really cool and go through like show you some of the things that I've recently acquired, whether they were gifts or things that like I managed to go and buy really cheaply, um, talk about like books and I'm into and shows and movies and find out what you guys are into and tell you about the creepy paranormal stuff that's happened, especially around work and stuff and the cool stuff and hear what you guys have to say and maybe talk about our pets and just all kinds of stuff. Um, but I'm struggling right now. Um, recently went through something extremely traumatic and normally I'm very open about anything that's going on in my life like I don't really care I just kind of tell it how it is because somebody else is going through it or has gone through it or will go through it um, so we can relate we can empathize and uh, and all of that good stuff and we can be here for one another but this is something that it doesn't concern just me and it's 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 really private so it's not really something that I can openly discuss um, but it was very very traumatic it has screwed me up for a little while so I'm struggling with the depression a lot right now and the anxiety is really high um, the temptation for self-harm which anybody that knows me knows that I am extremely <laughs> bipolar and I have ADHD and a slight obsessive compulsive and uh, anxiety panic disorder and and I'm a cutter and just not actively at the, at the moment um, but it's something I struggle with that's another subject maybe for another time and I really didn't want this to be a depressing video by any means um, however having gone through that a lot of things are on hold I started writing Finally, the Luguru Saga, which is something that ended up starting on Macabre Days, my old RPG forum that's been horribly neglected now for like a year and a half, two years, because I just haven't had the time to get on there and devote to it. And it's a huge site. Everything, and I mean everything, happens there. So it takes a lot of, of work. Um, and I have some amazing people on there that I just totally miss. Same with a couple of the other sites that I was on, um, Ultimate Buffy RPG, I miss you guys there too. So maybe this will be a little, little tiny way that we can interact with each other. I also finally joined Instagram, hey! Um, so aside from all of the normal busy stuff and the de crazy depression stuff, which also it's the seasonal depression kicking in because it's fall or winter technically now, so that it, it just has not been the best of times. But I, I, I do miss you guys all. I, I love you all and I'm sorry if I haven't been around to talk to or haven't been going out lately or responding to messages, things like that. It's just, it's difficult. I try, I'm not even really writing. I'm not writing the Lugaroo saga. I wanted that done by January 1st. That didn't happen. I wanted the whole book done, at least the first novel in the, in the series, in the saga. So hopefully I will get back to that. Um, I do have an appointment set up on Saturday for a new tattoo. Ooh, yeah! This will be like number 32, I think. <laughs> it's pretty bad. I can't remember how many tattoos I have. I got a lot. Um, so I'm going to go see Jen at Aloha Tattoo and Arts here in Boise. And what's really cool, she's one of my wifeys, and then another one of my wifeys is Jenny, and it's actually a drawing that she did. It's a skeletal hummingbird. I'll show you guys pictures um, if I don't. She's already got one on Instagram. I think I posted mine on Instagram as well. I'm Manic Malice at Instagram. Um, if you can't find me under Violet Violence, you'll find me under Manic Malice. I don't know what it is with the first and last name, moniker, things that have to start with the same letter. Maybe I just think that's really cool. I don't know. It's kind of how it goes. So that's what we're going to go with. Okay. Okay. I'm so cool. <laughs> I'm in a bit of a weird mood. Um, but I'm kind of, kind of sort of doing okay. So I just wanted to real quickly, you know, sorry that I haven't done any actual like vlogging and this is kind of sort of a vlog and kind of not a vlog. I mean, I guess it's a little vlog. 
I should be writing more of this down. Um, my thoughts are extremely chaotic and my hair is doing some cool stuff. Look at it all. Woo! Sticking up like crazy and stuff. <laughs> That's what happens when you have really, really dry weather and crazy frizzy hair like mine. Mm, it's pretty. I like it. Mm, I should die. Yes. Okay, screw it. I'm going to quit messing with my hair. Um, I might be able to get Macabre Days back up and running when I have some time. That would be awesome. I would love to do that and love to devote time again to RPing, to writing. There's, yeah, you guys inspire me so much on there. We've written some cool stuff and some weird stuff over the years. Uh, and I just can't do that. Like on Facebook, I don't have another outlet for the RPing and being able to switch on and off different characters like that. Um, haven't been filming anything, so I'm not working on any movies or anything right now. Uh, no real photo shoots, mostly because time, and I'm kind of doing that hibernation in my shell thing, which especially right now is needed, having to deal with a lot of, lot, lot of crap. Um, but I'm extremely thankful for all my friends and family. You guys are amazing. I love you so, so, so much. I can never express to you how much you mean to me, how much I care. It just, it, 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 it won't happen. There's no words. There's, there's no actions that can relay the depth of feeling. Um, so instead of like spacing off and staring off camera every once in a while, I'm not really looking at anything but blank walls because this is my old office, now my boss's office. It's kind of like a little corner in the back that I could sneak away to for a moment, take a second, film something quickly to throw up on there. <laughs> throw up. <laughs> to throw up on. Throw on to. Hey, that's better. Onto YouTube um, to do a quick little vlog. I do plan on as soon as possible getting back to writing the Lugaroo saga. That is going to be amazing. It's going to be a true saga. There are going to be many, many, many books in this. I have no idea how many I'm going to end up writing, but I want to get it written. I want to get it out to the public. I want to get it published. I think you guys will really enjoy it, especially if you like werewolves and magic and all that kind of. If you're into any paranormal uh, type fiction, be it like... Harry Dresden uh, by Jim Butcher or Laurel K. Hamilton's Anita Blake series, Mary Gentry series. Gosh, there's so I'm, I'm gonna like start screwing up authors, but there's like so many authors out there that write amazing stuff that I'm really Kim Harrison. Uh, I'm just gonna keep throwing out random names. Um, all those people have inspired me to write this, and if it wasn't for my sis in New Zealand, Kirsten, hi, I miss you, I love you. Um, that was the series would not have developed into what it is today. At least her and I are like the only people that know the full scope of it right now. Um, but I will get to it. It will get written. It will be out there. I just need a little bit more recovery time to get in order, which is always kind of chaotic and sporadic and strange. You get that little more, little more in order. So excuse the no makeup, excuse the shitty fluorescent lighting and the weird ramble. So I just wanted to take the second to let you guys kind of quickly know what's going on. We'll try to do something fun, possibly this weekend. I'll you know show you the new tattoo, show you some of the stuff I got for Christmas and other things that I've recently acquired. And like cause I got a cool makeup palette that I want to share and like we'll even try it on camera. Like I'll do some swatches and maybe we can come up with a cool, it's really glittery. I like the glittery sparkles. I'm always like, oh, it's shiny. I like it. I'm mesmerized. Shiny things distract me. Like I hope nothing goes off in the background, it makes it shiny. Cause I'll be all, oh, oh see ring shiny, ooh, shiny. Happens every time without fail. So I love you guys. I miss you guys. I hope to see some of you soon, talk to some of you soon, watch some of your videos, read your posts, look at your pictures, and all that crap that we do online. Um, any of you with any... Bleh, <laughs> I can't speak right now. I cannot enunciate my words correctly. Um, but to any of you that are also going through, I don't care if it's depression or anything personal, if you're going through something that's icky right now, I'm sorry. Um, I feel for you, my heart's with you, my thoughts are with you, you're not alone, and we'll all be okay. We'll join together in the paranormal circus, which is my paranormal circus, and because everything is weird here, <laughs> and we'll make it through, okay? Alright, I love you guys, thank you so much for hanging out for a second and watching, have a wonderful weekend, and I'll talk to y'all soon. Bye!